to be joined now by the head coach of the Badgers, Paul Christ. Coach, second year for you now as the head coach here. How does that change things in camp? I think our players know what to expect in camp, and we certainly know the players better. But other than that, there's still a group of 35 freshmen we're, we're getting to know, and it's their first time through. And it's a, you know, I thought we had last year we had some really good senior leadership. They're gone, chance for others to step up. So uh, there's still a freshness, a newness to it. But I think for the players as a whole, they've got an idea of what's around the bend. Coach, you're inside two weeks of the opener. How do you decide how much contact you need from this point to the game? That's uh, that's the question that you always try to go through, and we just re- we had a pretty good practice today and and went at it and yet our most of our players had two days off or a day and a half off so we thought it was a good time we're certainly going to back off after tomorrow and we'll start our game preparations and i think that's one area we still got to get better at though is how to practice and you have to be able to practice fast but stay up we had guys on the ground and so i think we're still uh trying to find that right amount of hitting and playing fast and yet still taking care of each other. How's the run game been developing? It was slowed a little bit last year due to injury, but how's it been going this year? Slowed a lot. <laughs> <laughs> it's It's been better. Yeah. I think there's a lot of guys that have taken ownership of it. And the linemen last year, many of them had an idea of what was going on, but I think now they truly understand why we're doing what they're doing. I think they knew who I had or what lines, how it was drawn in the playbook, but I think they're... There's nothing like experience, and they spent a ton of time you know, in the offseason looking at the film, and that's them on that film, and it, and it makes sense to them. And I think right now you know, we're more healthy at the running back spot. It's good to have Corey back. Dari has played in games. You know, Dari really hadn't played running back. Taiwan Deal played for the first time last year. So I think there's some experience. We've got a long ways to go in that area, and it's, it's been important to us. I like the strides we've made. I think we're going forward, but we still I think we've got a ways to go. You mentioned the change with the coordinator, and you have this fascinating situation now in the opener where you go up against LSU and your former coordinator in Dave Aranda. How does that impact the game, the fact that he knows you and your personnel so well and the fact that you know him and the way that he thinks so well? Well, I think it's it's a it's part of it, but it's not the story. And we were just talking here, and I don't really know who we're going to be offensively. Mm-hmm. You know, so how does Dave know who we're going to be? And and yet, what Dave did at Wisconsin the last three years might have different players. And so, how is he going to adjust that? And I think it's really important for our kids and for us as coaches. The game's still played between the lines, and those are the players, and we got to make sure they're prepared. And we certainly know some of the things that Dave likes. I thought it was more challenging when you'd play against, I remember when I was a coordinator here and you're playing against Iowa and there was the same looks and they knew exactly how we would attack them. Norm knew exactly what was coming. I knew what he would go with. And so I think that was almost, they knew more about you than necessarily, you know, we've got a lot of different faces and and we're doing some different things offensively. It's going to be the story, but I don't think it really is the main story. Well, you were discussing the unknowns of your offense quarterback being first and foremost. Do you have a sense of when you want to decide? Yeah. <laughs> Would you share it with us? No. <laughs> honest is it, man. That's is it, a, that is an honest is it man. possible you would play both quarterbacks? Yeah, I think that there's a possibility in that. But, you know, I think right now really did. And that's what I appreciate from Alex and Bart. Want him to focus on camp and getting better. And we still had enough pieces around it, particularly at the receiver position, where it was hard to make it an equal. Not every rep was the same rep. You had a different kid in there. And so I think that we will play you know, the best quarterback. And I think there's a chance that both could play, absolutely. But um, I think we still got some time in that way to figure it out. And it's, uh, I've appreciated how they've approached it and how our team has, has kind of gone with them as well. All right, head coach of the Badgers, Paul Chris. Thanks, coach. Thank you. <laughs>